Russian President Vladimir Putin is making a rare foreign trip to North Korea, a visit intended to further cement ties with an old ally that supports Moscow's war in Ukraine. Putin thanked North Korea for supporting his actions in Ukraine and said their countries will cooperate closely to overcome U.S.-led sanctions as he headed to Pyongyang on Tuesday for a summit with North Korean leader Kim Jong-un. In an op-ed piece in North Korean state media, Putin expressed his appreciation for North Korea's firm support of his military action in Ukraine and their joint opposition to what he described as Western ambitions to hinder the establishment of a multipolar world order. The two countries plan to develop trade and payment systems not controlled by the West and expand cooperation in tourism, culture, and education. Before visiting North Korea, Putin traveled to Yakutsk in eastern Russia, where he met with regional governor Isen Nikolaev and discussed technology and defense-related projects. Concerns have been raised about an arms arrangement between North Korea and Russia, with reports suggesting Pyongyang provides Moscow with munitions for the war in Ukraine in exchange for economic assistance and technology transfers. U.S. and South Korean officials have noted increased military and economic exchanges between North Korea and Russia since Kim Jong-un's meeting with Putin in 2019. Accusations of North Korean weapons transfers to Russia have been denied by both countries, despite concerns about potential violations of UN Security Council sanctions. Russia, along with China, has shielded North Korea from fresh UN sanctions over its weapons tests, with a Russian veto in March leading to the end of monitoring of UN sanctions.